I still feel like I'm just like some young kid trying to, you know, get to that next level and still trying to just build a name and still trying to just build on what I have. And it's not even about like, oh man, was that good enough? Like, did I do the hardest trick on this and that? And trying to be better than anyone else and, and compete with any other video parts that other people are putting out. It's more so just a timeline to look back and be like, damn, I remember that exact day. Traveling is uh, half of skateboarding. It's, uh, well, I guess skateboarding allows you to travel, so being able to do so is an amazing experience because, you know, you're basically getting to see the world all because you're riding this piece of wood, this skateboard. There's Laurel. Yeah, Laurel. Laurel. I'm blessed to have my friends out here, Laurel Gray and Corey White, and uh, you know, be able to see the world together and experience this whole thing together. That's what I'm saying. It's all about memories. It's all about looking back and being like, yo, you remember when we were in Barcelona? Like, you know, it's you need that in life. You gotta stick close to your friends, man. You brought snacks? This was 10 euros right here, at least. Hey, we got ham cheese. Cream cheese. I would just be here all day. Should we get a, try to get a trick? First try trick, fresh out of bed. Woo! I'm not usually this hyper. I'm just hyped to be a Barcelona. Stuff. Hey, you already know. <laughs> my Miles Silva, my Mark Suji, my Boo Johnson. Ready? This is a mecca of skateboarding, you know? Possibilities are endless, sky's the limit. You can't skate all these spots in a lifetime. Hey, aren't there other spots around here too? Mad spots. Like four or five at the same time. Okay. You wanna huck yourself? Nope. You wanna wall ride? Oh, and, and the You want a little ledge? ledge? Out ledge? Philippe may switch hard back tails out. Switch foot Smith. Back, Rodrigo. Switch foot Smith. That's what it's like. Switch foot Smith. That's what I So that freaking metal ledge is right here. It's down the hill. You just go and you just bomb it. But it can be kind of a bust sometimes. Nah, you get kicked out right when you go to Yeah. Like, you kind of got to like know what you want to do, be warmed up, go give it a try. Get kicked out, walk up the hill, go back down. Back home you have your routine, you have your everyday things that you do, you wake up in your same bed, you have your group of friends that you usually skate with. Out here you're just like, hmm, what can we skate? This is a big city. Let's see what happens. Waxman, Waxman. Dude, I would love to land this in like a couple tries. We can go to another spot. Oh, yeah, it slides, huh? You want more wax? You want more wax? Yeah, in the ground. Yeah, wake up. Chilly. You're on a backflip, dude. <laughs> Dude, 
we got kicked out by the local, I don't know, it's like a security guard or something. First time he was like, you gotta go, you gotta go. And I was like, last try, last try. And he's like, okay, one hour. It means one hour. And so we lucked out with that and he gave us a full hour to skate the spot. second guy comes back right when he rolled up uh, you know I landed on my trick so I was like come on bro like I was like one more try and he goes one more hour you know and I'm just like this is dope I just gotta put my finger up and say one Yeah, it looks sick, and I yeah, like that whole run, too. Yeah, I like no, no doubt. Before that, that flag run? Oh, we did. My G. All right, next spot. <laughs> Thank God. We did it. It's crazy, because going to spots, you push past so many amazing skate spots, and no one skates them because there's just already so many good spots here. They undermine the stuff in between the spots. Fools have probably done some stuff here. Uh, but no one really does it in a line, I don't think. There are these ledges, these concrete ledges everywhere. And then so you ollie up on the ledge, you have some time to set up, and you go over a trash can. And then they even have back-to-back -back ones where you can do more than one trick over each trash can. So it just looks so cool. You can just do lines for days. So when we first got there, it, the whole thing was, how do we skate this spot? How's first try? What's been done here, bro? I think Felipe did like front side flip and then switch front side flip in a line. Oh, he did. Help me out here, Brad, what can I do? Um, your bag of tricks goes pretty deep. So, help me out over here, Brad. What can I do? <laughs> yeah, trick up, over, trick up, over. You do a trick on this one, and then you carve through. I feel like it's a lot of time, though. What are you thinking? Switch 180 up, nollie heel that one. Okay. 180 up, take each other this one. What about like a nollie heel flip or a nollie flip over this one? No, nollie back heel, switch all the way up, and then that. Nollie back heel, switch all the way up, make each other. When we say ollie up, nollie heel, 180s, fake track. What do you say the first thing is? Ollie up, nollie hill, 180 up, fake track. I'd love that. That'd be so tight. Nollie back hill is too much, right? I mean, if you can do it, do it, but you don't need it. I don't know if I can get over that shit. I think you gotta give it a try. If it was easy, it wouldn't be worth filming. Let's give it a couple tries. So that's what makes me sweat. That's the one. Something, right? We just gotta land, so. Switch big here. get to trying a trick and you realize it's, it just doesn't feel right. Maybe I should try something else. Maybe a different trick will, could come a little easier or 
it might look better on film or it just feels better. So whatever, I was trying to switch Big Hill. I don't really do that trick. So then I switched it up. I did uh, switch 180 up the block, nollie back hill the can, switch ollie up the other one, and then I was like, maybe I'll try switch 360 at the end instead of switch picks me up. In the beginning, you're just like, all right, hopefully I can do this quick. My body's feeling good. I'm not sore. Legs are feeling good. I'm fresh. And then it starts to dawn on you when you're trying and trying it. You may be landing on your trick, falling off, realizing you're doing something wrong. It always dawns on you that, like, damn, what if I don't get it? What if I don't, I don't pull through this time around? It's just not clicking. So sometimes you get to the point where, all right, man, I'm done. It's stressful, but all in all, like you can't be mad at the scenery. You can't be mad at the lifestyle, the vibe you get here, so. Barcelona definitely is the best place. One of the best places to skate because of the energy and it's it's kind of hard to get stressed out here. Yeah, every time I pass this bush, I like it literally hits the lens like whoosh. I know you whoosh, lens in the bush. You know we got all the palm trees and everything. Just the beach view in the background. Oh, yeah, do that Barcy beach line. Woo! Let's, let's take it home right here. We got it, we got it. Let's go. Thank <laughs> you.